Good morning guys, morning. welcome to today. We ended the vlog in the car and we're starting the vlog in the car. It is 7.30 in the morning. We are racing to the barn because it is that day. The girls are riding um, an extra lesson today to prepare for the show. I didn't realize how much stuff was involved in the show. So they'll ride an extra lesson today and then on Friday, the night before the show, we'll all go to the barn at the same time and we'll all work together to get our horses prettied and everything, all of our tack ready. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy. It's crazy, are you guys nervous? No. Yeah. Morning guys. Morning. Uh, you're not nervous, Sophie? No. You are nervous, Gabby? Yeah. Yeah, like. It's a lot, you guys. Sophie's probably like, you have to all do it for me. I'm the youngest, why should I be nervous? But she's not really a nervous person. It's just me and Kat. Anyway, welcome to today, and let's get this day started. We go to the bank and get out money, and I have no idea how much it's gonna be, so I always get out like more money than I think it's gonna be. So I, so I had to go to the bank machine, and it's so confusing. So they wanna give me like all in hundreds and fifties, but I need change too because it's not gonna be just all hundreds and fifties. So it, the machine is so crazy. So I get everything exactly right. And then I push one more button and then it turn, changes it so that I have like $505 bills. And like, it's just annoying. So anyway, I thought I had it completely right. And then I pushed, give me the money. And then this happened. Took the money out. And it was this big of a stack of money. And I'm like, whoa, wait. That is not normal. That is not what I wanted. And I ended up getting all these, all these $5 bills. Like I did not want, all, like it, it's super thick you guys. Oh no, I just lost all the money. If you can do anything for yourself, wake up a little bit early, spend some time sitting and relaxing, have your coffee or your water or whatever you drink in the morning and then get moving. Cause whenever I wake up and hit the ground running, everything <laughs> turns out crazy. And turns off. Sophie's like, I'll have all this money. You are a chunker. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't mind us saying that. Thanks, kiddo. Hi, Storm. Having breakfast? Yeah, I mean, she certainly looks like she has found her. Yeah, she's got the swoopy she's toe. The, yeah. He said her white line didn't look horrid. She doesn't have much of a fall. No. And that's what he said. He goes, and if it happened, it didn't happen like right yesterday. And her feet aren't like screaming hot. Well, she's been here. She came Friday night at midnight. Pony came. He looked like this. It took me five months. That's right. Yeah. Oh my God, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't. It's not something that you can do overnight. No, I told him. I said she'll be a different horse in four months. But we're lucky enough that we. Well, lucky she does not on grass here, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's sort of a normal abnormality. So as they age, these front teeth go from being straight yeah. to, yes, to, point to like this. Yeah. And there's a period of time where the top tooth and the bottom tooth make contact in a funny way. Yeah. So how old so is this piece doesn't get worn um, like, it, like it should. Yeah. Longer needle to get to the muscle. <laughs> <laughs> you can feel it. Oh, yeah, we're gonna walk her every day. And she loves walking.
Storm's like, this is like a night show. This is like the night show. <laughs> He's watching the whole thing. <laughs> right, so um, we took a chance on Stella, you guys. Like, um, we're gonna talk a little bit more about where she came from, what she's been doing um, the last few years. And we ended up, when we went to see her, we took a chance because her personality was amazing and we knew she was gonna be the right kind of a ride for us, for Sophie. And we took a chance and it paid off. Everything happened exactly fell into place for us to get her and the vet said that he she doesn't need x-rays that um she doesn't show any signs of any problems with her feet that looks like she did looks like she did found her in the past uh not recently not even close to recently he concurred with the farrier that shoes are gonna fix her we just gotta give her a little time and her main issue is what? teeth. what's her main issue wait what is it She's fat. Fat. Yeah. She's so fat. So people were wondering why the heck was Sophia riding her yesterday when she just got her shoes on? Why, Soph? Um, so she can lose weight faster. Yeah. So she's allowed to be ridden. Um, we're not doing anything more than a walk, slow and steady, and she needs to walk. That's the biggest part of her weight loss journey is going to be walking, walking, walking. Sophie's not going to ride her today because she had a bunch of shots, but we'll be back at it tomorrow, right? Yeah, so anyway, we are super happy. Um, <sighs> weight lifted off our shoulders. Sophie, you have a pony. You have a horse. Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Four months and she'll look completely different. Isn't that in fall? Yeah. Okay. By fall, you're going to have an awesome, stellar horse. Stella. Stella. Holy cow. Look at this field. Remember when it looked like that field over there? Now it's like hardly no grass. <laughs> it's all nice and cut. Horses are amazing. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to leave them on here for like two years. Or yeah. Like they will oh my gosh. Gabby, so, uh, what have you been into? What? I don't care. You got a mustache here. <laughs> blush over here. Brown blush. Look at Journey. I didn't know Journey had blush. I'm so getting tired. No, crazy. He likes quiet legs though. He does like quiet legs. Like quiet legs and quiet hands. You need your feet when you need them and then leave them alone. He's forgiving in that he doesn't care, but. Thumbs on top. There. Come, come, come with me. I'm gonna get this party lit. Come, come, come. Good boy. Eight forward. I can see you kicking him in the belly. There they go again. Kick and kick and kick and kick. Thank you. Leave his belly alone.
Over the poles, let's change direction. Push your heels down and forward. We're gonna go to a walk in a moment. When you go to your walk, lift your hands up and bring your elbows straight back. And walk. Beautiful! When you think about it, that is lovely. Canter. And then, and then just hold that little loop. So let go for a second. And hold that loop. And then Good. Side around outside leg. leg only. Sit and outside leg. So this there. is the You're just going to tie that. You're going to tie that? Yep. Yep. Bring Light that feet. Bring that around. Stretch those heels nope. down and helmet up. I want to see how Bring straight you can make yourself. Bring that through my thumb. Look at me. Pull your body apart. Yeah.
I spray? Put like this stuff. Citronella. She's like the, yeah. the citronella beeswax stuff. And look at his. Oh, she put it on his hook. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can. I like it's it. It's really it good for like fly spray, um, hoof oil. And it's really good. Yeah, it's really good for all yeah, that stuff. stuff. So we have all the other stuff, but this stuff yeah. smells now the best. You are such a good boy. He's like so excited to be jumping now that he kind of gets it better. And he's so snuggly. Like he loves to be. My mare's worse. Yeah, your mare is super snuggly. But he didn't always love like he loves. And he's resting his head right on me. He's like, yes, touch me, touch me. So we have this MTG, and that's what we're trying on his tail right now. And fungus, rain rot, girth itch, ah. Oh. Scratches, sweet itch, tail rubbing, dry skin, bug bites, mane. It's like pure grease. Is it pure grease? I don't know. So look, that Gabby's giving him a rub, rub down. It's safe and for small animals, skin mm. problems such as I don't like mind it bad. It smells like campfire bacon. Yeah. I like it. Petroleum distillate, sulfur, zinc, stearate, glycerin, and cat oil. Cat oil? Cat oil. Oh. Cat oil? C-A-D-E. Cab. Oh. Ready? He's like, I don't care. Just do it. Look at that cute face. He's smelling. Rub you're a pretty boy. Pumpkin. He's like, you guys are rubbing his butt, and he's like, oh, that feels so good. <laughs> there you go. You can keep it in your locker. I like that stuff on his feet. So you that... can't use it every day. Oh, okay. I just asked Gabby, did you guys notice a difference in Storm's jumping? I felt like he felt stronger and more excited about it. I feel like he's doing so good, you guys. Um, I felt like her jumps were better. Like, she was still really nervous, but I feel like he did really well. On the weekend, I showed we showed you guys how um, he did the 18-inch um, division, and we left because we wanted to meet Zara, and... Um, I guess he jumped the two foot division after that and it did so well. He came second and the only reason he didn't take it was because um, he tripped, the sand was really thick and he tripped. But she said that without Gabby constantly being nervous on him and kind of pulling him back, he really learned like, wow, I love jumping. This is so cool. And he really likes a quiet hand and quiet legs. So. Um, I just need to get Gabby there where she can see the difference in him and see like it's hard riding a new horse and it's been three months but it feels like sometimes she's going backwards in the jumping. She really wants to do it but she holds herself back. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.